Today, we're going to open the bottle of 1988 Chateau Talbot. Beautifully complex wine, so the array of flavours on the nose ranging from sort of Lantana and Salvation Jane to cooked meat and um, yeah, just a really pretty engaging nose. The palate, mid palate expression is just beautiful though, lovely intensity, concentrated. Um, I think today's a good day to be drinking this wine, um, just lovely. Beautiful wine, um, however I disagree slightly, I think this would actually would have been just a smidge better a year or two ago, I think it's, it's gone hit the peak and started to go down a little bit and uh, certainly want to drink it now and not leave it too much longer because mm. that would be an absolute total waste but right now it's got beautiful meaty beefy sort of characters and it's a great front palette and just starting to fade a little bit on the finish which is why I think it's uh, um, just a bit over its peak. Very nice wine. Um, it, it, it's good to be drinking it now because it hasn't got very much longer. I don't think um, the the you know the tannins are any they're present, but they're they're fading as is the acid. But um, the nose just goes on endlessly. It's deep, it's dark, it's brooding. It's got smoky notes, cedary notes. It's got um, you know fruit really able to really smells of tea. It just goes on and on and on. Um, you know, the palate's you know, beautiful and refined. It's not, it's not a, a dense wine. It's sort of dense on the, on the palate. It's lovely, very, very nice. Mm. Absolutely love the, the, the bouquet of this wine. Um, you know, things that, that I, I really love in aged Cabernet and aged Bordeaux, tar and tobacco. There's still a real good core of raspberry in there. Um, there's also a, a real a lick of mint um, and, and it's, uh, as Wes mentioned, there's also some really nice black tea characters in there as well. Um, palette I'm not as impressed with. I, I tend to agree with Dan that um, it's, it's just drying out a little bit on the finish of it. Um, it's still tangy, ripe, um, but I, I tend to really get fruit more on the front palate and it tends to really ease off. Um, so it's starting to get a little bit unbalanced, but um, I'd still, it'd still be a very enjoyable one now. Mm -hmm.